Hey guys, it's Kayla. Welcome back to another video. I know I haven't posted in a while. I've been posting like how to get your account back on like TikTok and Instagram and that's about it. But I'm going to get back to pranks. I'm going to get back to like talking videos and my opinions and just stuff that you guys want to know. So as you see by the title of this video, I'm going to be talking about how to make money on OnlyFans, how much money I have made and... If you're looking at making an OnlyFans, watch this video. So right now, I'm just doing my hair. I'm about to head to the mall. And then I have to do my makeup because I look ridiculous right now. But I was like, you know what? I haven't filmed in a long time. So let's just get into it. I don't remember when I started, but I know it was in November either last year. I think it was last year. I've been doing it for, I don't know, a little over um, half a year now. And I've made thousands. I'm not going to give like an exact number, but just know it is very, very good money. So if you're looking at starting an OnlyFans, what do you have to have? You have to have followers on other accounts. Now, I'm just going to be honest with you. You can't have 100 followers on Instagram and then expect to make thousands on OnlyFans. Um, I think TikTok is the best way to like promote it. Um, and that doesn't mean, you know, put it in the bio or say, oh, go subscribe to my OnlyFans. Because, of course, you're going to get banned. But, you know, get cute, do your hair and makeup, put on a cute outfit, and kind of, like, hint that you have one. And a lot of people are then going to subscribe there. Another place is Twitter. That is the only place where I, um, I mean, I let everyone know, like, on my Instagram, like, Snapchat, TikTok, kind of sometimes. Um, that I have an OnlyFans, but the main place that I um, promote it is Twitter, and it is because there is a lot of, um, how do you say it? Yeah, so basically that's where I promote it, and the first day I got over um, a thousand dollars, but that wasn't even just the day, that was like in a couple hours, like and I only promoted it, I think it was on Instagram. And I had probably like a little over like 10,000 followers. Um, and my set price has always been $25. Sometimes I will do discounts. And that is only for like my like top subscribers for that month or like holidays, stuff like that. Like for Christmas, I might put it down to like $15. Like you're not getting this for cheap. But anyway, yeah, I think if you are looking into doing it, you just have to be, like, motivated. Like, a lot of people are going to hate on you. A lot of people are going to, like, make fun of you. Um, you just kind of have to do you. You kind of have to do your own thing. It's your own time, so don't feel pressured. Like, if someone says, oh, like, I'm going to unsubscribe if you don't send me this. You can post whatever you want. There's literally people that have OnlyFans that literally post, you know adult content and there's people that post completely different stuff like their artwork or beauty hacks like or unseen videos if they're like a tiktok or a youtuber you know just like different things like it's not always adult content like i just think it's crazy like i kind of paint myself out to be like a lingerie model on OnlyFans. that's kind of if someone asks me like you know what do you do i'm just like yeah like I'm about to do this because I'm about to open up a business probably soon, but like as of right now, I'm just laundry model. How to make more money on OnlyFans. First thing, you have to have a social media following. Does not mean you have to have a million followers or subscribers anywhere else. Just means that you have to have like a couple thousand, like specifically on Twitter um, and reach out to people don't wait for people to reach out to you you know sometimes i'll just randomly dm people my only fans link and then i'll get 10 new subscribers like you have to like not be shy i guess and just go for it just go for it so basically another way is you can get money from messages so let's say i'm just throwing out a number let's say i get ten thousand dollars a month from subscriptions that's people buying it um i can message people um like a selfie and put five dollars on it and 
they can open my message and if they want to see that photo it's going to be blurred off but it's going to have the price they're going to have to pay five dollars that is five dollars right there so i might make ten thousand in subscriptions a month and five thousand in messaging and you can also get tips on things that you post so it does really add up um and i think it's like a really good investment i'm not trying to like say you have to be pretty or say that you have to have a lot of um followers on somewhere else but it does help you know I know people personally that don't have a bunch of followers and they've made decent money off of OnlyFans but it is just like I don't know like a handout if you do have a bunch of followers it does really really help you out because then you then you can like kind of take them and be like hey like followers over here come follow me over here and you can also make like deals with them so you can say you know like let's say you have 200 subs you can say if i get to 300 subs then i will post this that has really helped me because i'm like okay like making deals with them gets me more subs which equals what more money um but yeah i do want to talk about like the hate and stuff if you're a girl watching this and you do think about doing only fans um be honest with the people around you like because it's going to come out eventually like my whole family knows that i do it like it's fine um just be honest basically and i'm not saying you have to like let everyone know like what you're doing but just save yourself the trouble you know what i mean but i do my makeup but basically um just don't listen to people like hating on you and stuff because you're always gonna get that hate you're always gonna like have someone hating on you even if you are so happy in life and you're doing amazing there's always gonna be that one person hating on you so just deal with it do you because that's what I've learned to do I'm like over people judging me I'm over people saying oh like how are you a Christian and do only fans cuz I can <laughs> like I'm not pointing out what everyone else is doing but um i will put my referral link in the description so if you do want to sign up go ahead and use that and if anyone else has like more questions about like what i do or just questions that you want to know in general like for me to make a youtube video like only fans related or not just go ahead and comment um on this video um I'm trying to think what else I also made a backup Instagram. It's Kayla Blosky with three eyes. So if you want to go ahead and follow me there, that's where I'm going to be posting a lot more. Like on my main account, that's just like something I'm just going to leave there and post like once in a blue moon or like when I start a family, I'll be like a family page. But as of right now, I am just chilling. But I'm going to do my makeup real quick. And this broke. I'm going to do my makeup real quick and I will be back. All right, guys, I'm back. Literally only took like five minutes because I'm used to doing my makeup like super quick because I remember like in high school, like I would, some days I'd wake up like at six in the morning and actually, you know, sometimes I wake up like freaking five in the morning and get hella ready for high school and other days I would just be like freak it, wear no makeup and then the days like this to where I'm like in a rush, I'd have to do my makeup in five minutes. That's why I'm, I'm not like a makeup person like if you tell me and a group of other girls hey do your makeup as fast as you can i'm gonna win like it might not look the best but i will do it very very fast but anyway um some other tips that i was thinking about while i was doing my makeup is you have to be consistent and that means post every single day i mean of course the days that you're like sick and or very busy um you're not obligated to post but to maintain the same amount of subscriptions and more you're gonna have to post every day and I realize that because there's times that I'm just like getting comfortable with my subs and the money intake and stuff and I'm like you know what I'm not gonna post this week and then you lose 10 subscribers and how much money is that I mean it might not seem like a lot because you might pull in those 10 subs somewhere else the following week when you post but then you could have had 20 so 
I just try to like stay consistent even the days that I really dread posting or if I'm really sick another way to get really good money if you don't feel like posting is like I said messaging so sometimes at you know one two in the morning if people are wanting photos or if I haven't posted in a couple days which I usually don't do that anymore I usually post um, a couple times a day I will message people on there and it's not just you know if you are gonna do like adult content or whatever it's not just oh send me this send me that like some of them just want to conversate with you some of them literally just want to know you and like get to know more about you some of them will offer to you know meet up with you in person and buy you this and you know take you on vacations and everything like seems nice and you get a lot of opportunities um, you know doing only fans having a lot of subscribers but you know I turn most of them down for obvious reasons but um, conversating is like the number one thing and I think it's like conversating and because there's sometimes like I literally will just conversate and not send anything and they'll just send me like a $30 tip just for talking to them just for saying hey have a good day and like I'm like, bro, like, thank you, but you didn't have to. Like, all I said is have a good day. Like, it's my obligation because you're already paying $25 a month, you know? So, to give me more money just for saying have a good day, like, that's crazy. But my subs are just amazing. And I'm pretty sure you guys are watching this, so thank you for everything that y'all do. But, um, no, I just think, like, the messaging and promoting are the number one um, things that you have to do literally have to do to make really good money now I know there's like some famous women out here that have only fans and they literally just post like once a month and they get millions and they don't message anyone and I'm just like damn that's crazy but I actually like there's some days you know I actually enjoy like you know talking with these people um, and there's other days that I break down and cry and I'm like, this is really not what I want to do But you do gain friendships on there and a lot of money and It's easy money you work from home But sometimes like I said before it can get tough and You will break down and cry if, if you really do take it seriously. It's gonna get stressful You're gonna get a bunch of hate specifically if you are famous on the internet and not easy it's easy money but it's not easy I posted that on Twitter <laughs> the other day because it was facts like I feel like people just look at me and they're like oh you just take pictures of your body and you're rich no that's not how it is it's really not but um yeah I hope I answer some of y'all's questions or give you like more of an insight on what I do and how I make my money if you think about doing it like I said the referral link is in my description so just click that and you can start your own account right now but hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys later make sure to comment video ideas because I'm having a hard time like figuring out what you guys want to see and I've just been very busy so I don't really know like um, what kind of content to post but like I said, I'm going to start making more videos soon. I feel like I say that like every single video, but I'm really, really serious this time. So go ahead and comment what you want to see from me and I hope you enjoyed this video.